On Friday, April 24th, the MIAA released an official statement saying all spring sports and tournaments were canceled due to schools being closed for the remainder of the school year. While this outcome was not completely shocking, it is a sad and disappointing end for many student athletes. Our own Chris Dugan caught up this week with Needham High School Athletic Director Dan Lee to talk about where the attention turns to now. The official announcement from the MIAA Board of Directors came last Friday, but essentially everyone knew what it meant when Governor Baker closed down schools for the remainder of the school year. So it was really last Tuesday that, that we understood what was happening and the MIAA's formal announcement was really just a formality because if we weren't going to be back in school then there was no way that you could conceivably have a, a spring season. So while the official announcement came on Friday, we all knew what was happening once Governor Baker made that decision last Tuesday. As we talked about before, the whole situation really this month of April has been so fluid and sort of a, a holding pattern and wait and see what we we're going to do. And we were preparing to return on May 4th. And once we got the word that we weren't going to return on May 4th, then we have to shift gears a little bit. So it was obviously very disappointing. I know our student athletes are crushed. Our coaches are very disappointed as well. Everyone was really looking forward to try to salvage some type of spring season. So even though in the back of our minds, we kind of knew it was coming, it was still, it was very disappointing when, when the governor made that, that decision. So really this past week has been working with, with our coaches and having them work with their athletes on sort of coming to grips with it. And our coaches have done a tremendous job staying in contact with our student athletes through Google Meets or, or Zoom meetings or uh, you know, giving them stuff to do to keep them engaged and positive and, and, uh, and helping them work through it because it's, it's difficult on everyone. And sort of where we're at now is we're looking at different ways that we can recognize and celebrate our spring athletes, uh, especially the seniors. It's really, really disappointing for them not to be able to put on that Needham uniform one last time and, uh, and represent our, our, our program and their high school and the town. So we're looking at different ways. We're working with the, the Booster Club and our coaches and sort of brainstorming different ways that we can, we can celebrate our athletes. We've been having weekly coaches roundtables that uh, Mr. Jackson has, has set up where our coaches can stay connected and talk shop, talk different ways to handle different situations. And it's, uh, it's been coaches from all seasons, all levels. It's a great way to share information. And uh, our most recent meeting on Monday revolved around ideas and ways that we could recognize and celebrate our, our senior athletes in the, in the next month, month and a half. So a lot of good ideas came out of that meeting. So we're trying to see what, what can work uh, logistically, what will be allowed by, by the school, by the district, by the state to see, you know, what, what, what can we do to, to properly give these seniors uh, the send off they deserve.